President David Granger says ExxonMobil signing bonus was kept under wraps as a matter of national security. Sunil Williams has the details. It's not a question of secrecy, you know. Um, evidence of non-disclosure is not, uh, is not, um, does not mean that uh, there's evidence of any um, intention of deception. You know, um, there's no intention to deceive, but there was no need to to make it public. It's a pub, it's, it's it's a governmental decision. I make governmental decisions all the time, but it's not deceptive. The transaction was conducted in that manner because there were some national security implications. Earlier this month, it was disclosed by ExxonMobil Guyana country manager Rod Henson that the approximately U.S. $18 million signing bonus was deposited into the Bank of Guyana last year. In the oil industry, signature bonuses are given to countries after the completion of a production-sharing contract with an oil company, meaning negotiations. The head of state said the monies were not placed into the consolidated fund, mainly because at that time it was the advisable thing to do. It is a legitimate exercise, as I said. It is to be used for certain matters which we perceive to be of, of national security interest. And um, at that point in time, it was, it was the thing to do so that we could have access in the event of a national security emergency. The head of state further noted that not all ministers may have seen the contract. The government plans to disclose the contract signed with ExxonMobil before the end of this year. Zanil Williams reporting for InfoHub.